thought I would do a quick segment today on um, caring for your hair while you're here in Bangkok. Um, if you have uh, colored hair like I do, one of the things that you are, look for when you're in Bangkok is the products that they have available um, to color and take care of your hair. So um, I thought I would take some time and take a look at some of the local products here. Um, I did choose one product um, that uh, seems to be fairly good and as you can see I'm um, using it now and it seems to be uh, changing my hair color the way I want it to, but we'll see. Anyways, this is uh, one of the products I found here that's local. Uh, once again, it is in English, which is great. Um, this product here is really good in, in pricing anyways. It cost about uh, 71 baht, or 79 baht. So that's uh, probably around uh, 250 something like that, $2.50 Canadian US. Um, so really good deal. Um, it, the product itself, it's uh, just like at home. Uh, there's a developer and a cream and you mix it together. The only thing is it doesn't come with all the fancy things like it does at home, like um, you know, a mixing bottle and all that. You have to uh, um, put it in a bowl and mix it yourself, but it pretty much works the same. It comes with one glove. <laughs> And uh, the nice thing is it actually smells pretty good. It's not uh, as harsh as the smells of, uh, this. it doesn't have as harsh a smell as the ones that you get at home. So anyways, that is uh, one product. Now this is of course uh, light golden blonde, um, but they have many colors here and many other products as well. Um, so for you ladies out there, if you come to Bangkok and uh, you're looking around for uh, products to take care of your hair, um, you can get this at any uh, local uh, tops, Big C, uh, any of the Boots uh, drugstores they have here. Um, but uh, you can also find them at the local markets um, down any of the soys. Um, they sell this product and uh, it's roughly about the same same price. You can get. Uh, Hair day products like Ferrier and L'Oreal, like you would at home. Um, they don't have as many selection of colors, um, and the cost is much much higher. Um, they average around uh, two to three hundred baht. Now, the other thing I wanted to talk to you guys about um, is shampoo here. So, um, one word of caution: um, they have some products here that look like this. It is all in Thai, except for maybe a word in the back that says conditioner. Don't know if you guys can see that. Probably not. But pretty much everything else outside of the ingredients is in Thai. So uh, you want to be careful um, with this type of product here. Um, it is um, a great conditioner, and there's a shampoo as well, but um, it will actually dye your hair. So this particular product is apparently, I found out, for brown hair. And so um, if you do have brown hair, it's probably great for, for um, your hair because it puts a bit of a, um, an under sheen of, of brown, uh, actually more orangey red brown in your hair. Um, but if you have blonde hair or dyed blonde hair, um, it will turn your hair a nice subtle shade of orange, which is why I am dyeing my hair, again. So, um, just a word of caution, um, they have these that come in black as well, so I'm not sure what the undertone of black would be, but probably more of a, a blue shine, perhaps. So, just a word of caution for you ladies out there, when you do come to Thailand and Bangkok, just keep an eye out for these products. Um, if you don't want to change your hair color, stay away from these ones and go for your normal um, uh, uh, products that you see at home. Uh, you can get them here as well. They're a little bit more expensive, uh, maybe about 100 baht, 150 baht, but uh, they will work well. Okay, so anyways, wanted to do just a real quick segment on uh, caring for your hair when you're here in Bangkok, and um, I think my timer's just up. I'm going to go wash this out and uh, see what happens. Thanks for joining me.